SR9009 benefits that I've noticed. There's never a time where I've been bigger and leaner at the same time and where it happens so rapidly. The one thing that happens is I get, like as you see me right here, this is on like nothing at all. I'm this lean on nothing. So on 9009, let's say my calories are exactly the same, like 2,400, 2,500. I get single digit body fat within like less than two weeks easily. Like I'd say this is 10, 11% right here. I easily drop two to 3% from this in two weeks easy without even changing anything bone density okay old injuries that tweak me if i had to fight for some reason and i had money on the competition for one i would want the that endurance that comes with it for two just the way you could probably in theory bounce back from an injury like that those things okay so leanness fullness endurance injury recovery only needing five to six hours of sleep per night these things are the main things like didn't need much sleep fucking old injuries just it was like they didn't even exist when i was on the compound when my rat was downsides okay the sleep being so like the way you just, you don't need five more than five or six on it. It got a little weird for me. And on top of that, just a bit of dehydration. But it was a very nice trade off because I fasted, used my pH drops and, you know, took my time off, man. Um, that's the basics of it. Love to hear what you guys experienced on it. I wanna expand on this a little bit. You know, I figure you guys probably already know what our SR9009 is. It speeds up the circadian rhythm, and it's one of those things that the more you move on it, the more fat you lose. So I wanna expand a little bit. If you're a very active person and you take this, I can see that really dropping some insane body fat. And the staying hydrated part, the intermittent fasting part, these all really come together. When I say staying hydrated, I mean, pH drops, right? Two to four drops per eight ounces of water. And then at the very least, some sodium, 2000 milligrams per gallon of water is probably a good place for most people to start. Depends how much you're sweating, depends how much you're moving. And then, you know, you gotta back off of that stuff around your meals and this is where it comes down to really tracking these things. And that's what I've found, right? Eating the same meals every day that's like for me it's ground beef blueberries greek yogurt some broccoli some organic shredded cheese usually i have a, a little bit of that maybe some peanut butter and it's it's just very basic stuff it's low carbohydrate it's very filling it makes it very easy to cut the main injury i have is like like in my mid back it's where i'm the most tense and when i when my rat is on this, he, it's like it just almost starts putting his back back together. And that's where there's most likely some bone density, insane bone density benefits, some insane healing properties. And, you know, if you were to combine that with pH drops, right, alkalize the body fast and speed up the circadian rhythm speeding up your immune system most likely or at the very least helping it you gotta think what does that do to diseases and stuff man i mean really it's uh it is a very cool one and you know as long as you have the discipline to follow your meals and stay hydrated on it and like i said stay hydrated with electrolytes not just drinking plain water it's a very unique one that I don't want to I don't want to say everybody should try right because if you have a pre-existing condition I can't diagnose you but it's definitely one if you're healthy and you're young and you want to drop some body fat or try to heal an injury or just push the limits fuck man it's crazy